Hello, all you beautiful people. Welcome back, or <laughs> if this is your first time, welcome to my channel. Today we're going over a quick tutorial on how to fix replay mod for sodium versions and how to get FFmpeg installed all in one so you don't have to look across multiple videos. First of all, you need to start by recording a replay. I'm going to do a weird spruce structure. It doesn't really matter what you're building, replay mod will capture it all. And then we'll... Oh, no, I did not mean to do that. But it still saved the replay mod file. So we'll go here, check it out, load it up. But what's the issue? Oh, our render button does not work because it says it's missing support for the Frex Flawless Frames API. No worries. Exit the replay. Quit Minecraft because you can't use Minecraft and change it at the same time. So the first website you're going to want to go to is Replay Mod. You're going to press the download and you'll get a bunch of nice options here of course this will all work if you have fabric and just skip to the, the time frame on the video right here if you already if you're using fabric and not sodium if you just want to install ffmpeg but you're going to click on click to show compatible sodium versions but you're going to click on your version of minecraft currently i'm using 1.18.1 .1. i'm going to click download and now it's down there so then you're going to open up your files for yours. For me, it's just open folder and then it's all there. But for you, it would be if you're using Windows, you're going to press r slash uh, percentage run. You're going to type in app data like this percentage app data percentage. And then it should open up to your dot Minecraft folder. And it's technically the same. This one has a little bit more because it's my main but you're gonna to wanna to locate your mods folder. If you don't have one, just create a folder, name it mods, all lowercase. And I'm gonna close this, cause you can just look off here and I already have it installed perfectly on there. But mods, and then you're gonna locate your sodium fabric MC. This one, it does not work. I'm gonna drag and drop your new sodium fabric into the mod, or you can just delete it straight from here. It doesn't matter, you want the new one. Click the refresh, it'll fix it, and then you're done fixing replay mod. Now, getting FFmpeg to work is a little bit different. So you're gonna wanna load up Minecraft again. And once you load up Minecraft, you're gonna click the little replay viewer here, and you're going to click on your replay. Now, you already have the keyframes there, and the time ones, so all you need to do is go back to this little render camera path and it says render, but it says you need to have FFmpeg installed and that's what we're going to do now. So we're going to exit out of Minecraft, don't close it, don't close it. We're going to click on FFmpeg, click on this download key. Go over to Windows, and then click on the first one from giant.dev. Now, this is this is the page as of April 12th, 2022. It could be different, but all you need to look for is the mirror at GitHub, and click on that. It should not be too hard to find. And then click on the essentialsbuilds.zip. Okay, so once you have FFmpeg installed, you're gonna open it up, and then you're gonna extract all. And once it's done extracting, you're gonna go back to your downloads, you're gonna grab the new one, just put it on your desktop just so it's easy to grab. Now all you're gonna do is close all your windows and your folders, open it up, go to this PC, click on Windows C or whatever one has your program files x86 file, uh, file folder. Open that up and then all you're gonna do is you're gonna drag and drop this into the program files file and once it's in there you want to quickly rename it just to ffmpeg open that up click on bin and once you're up here click on this and just copy it by left clicking now all you got to do go here scroll down a bit in the command file control v what you did backslash ffmpeg dot exe that's all you got to do just 
type in ffmpeg after the backslash after bin here.exe. Now, when you press render, it should work. And there we go. If you click the open video folder, look at your replay, realize this is amazing. Thank you so much. And I will see you all in the next video. So, thanks for watching. I'll see ya.